Kevin here from Whole Fleet Diagnostics. Um, just looking at another of the uh, awesome features added to version 23.2, um, one of which is the ability to see the dynamic system view uh, during a regeneration. So here we're going to go into a, uh, let's pick a Detroit DD15. Um, so we'll go to Detroit Diesel MBE, we'll go to DD series. Uh, let's do a DD13, DD15, uh, GHG21. Um, Doing a regen, we're going to force that through that common powertrain controller here. So I'm going to go ahead and connect to the common powertrain controller. Uh, and then this is going to bring up a diagnostic dashboard for that uh, common powertrain controller, uh, from which under the maintenance section, we're going to be able to uh, select the particular filter regeneration procedure. So I'm going to go through there, click a regular uh, forced regeneration. And then in here, uh, we're going to get a whole bunch of information about the, uh, the regen process, a little diagram of the uh, after treatment system itself. Uh, when we're ready to go, make sure that the conditions are met. Hit start. Uh, we don't need to in the simulator here. Um, but uh, this should start up a regeneration. We're going to have an opportunity here to see all of our, our live data. And then if we click on the uh, dynamic system display here, uh, you're going to be able to see the, uh, the exhaust after treatment system itself and then the values of different sensors and actuators throughout this after treatment system. So we can see live data readings, we can watch our temperatures rise, we can watch our differential pressure change um, and, uh, and also our NOx levels throughout the, the regen, um, the, the regen uh, function. So this Prior to uh, this version, um, typically this was just a, a you know a series of gauges. There, there wasn't that um, you know that dynamic or the system display included in there as well. So this is a nice handy feature here. We can access this at any time throughout our regen. Along with that, we can you know see graph of different uh, different values if we want as well. Um, so different ways to view the data here during that regen process. Um, and then uh, when we're done here and we're finished our regen we can also see uh, or or view that uh, that data after the fact and we can add it to our diagnostic report as well um, so really cool um, features for your regenerations uh, through the gel test software and then the added bonus of now being able to see a dynamic system display um, that that shows the values of different sensors um, on the uh, on the after treatment system um, itself. So uh, another really cool feature for me, uh, very excited about this one. Um, I know it's one that had been requested um, by by multiple whole fleet customers. Uh, it's here now, um, and uh, take advantage of that. Uh, if you have any more questions or anything you want to see, please comment below. Uh, make sure you follow us. Uh, we'll see you next time.